What is up guys, this is Moritz here from Section Store and today we will be having a look at this image with text section right here. It does come with this little block right here, which represents a little sub headline, a main headline, some text and also a button. And on the right side, as you can tell, there's some images which also come with an automatic slider and you can customize every slide to your likings and also what your brand is also getting represented for. So I'll just say we jump right into it and I'll show you how you can install this and customize it to your very own store. All right, first thing I did for that was I headed on over to the Shopify app store where I got the section store app. It's a component library, fully free non-subscription app with over 190 fully customizable components, which you can get for Shopify only. And after that, we can just head on over right here and type an image with text and find the section I just used. Like I said already, app itself is completely free. This is one of our premium sections though, and it does come with a one-time charge of $9. It means if you bought it once, you will own it forever. You're not gonna need an expensive developer. And I think at the end of the day, you will save yourself a lot of time and money and still end up with a really nice looking section, which is in the long-term gonna boost your conversion rate. All right, after successfully getting it, head back to the My Sections area where you can find a collection of all of your sections. And before actually being able to use that, you have to click on add theme and then add it to the theme you're using. It does work on every theme. I'm using the Dawn Light theme. And after doing that, you can just open it up in the theme editor. I've already opened up the theme editor right here. So that is the one I used. And to start completely from scratch, I'm just gonna get rid of this one. So I can show you how the default version looks and how you can customize it to your likings. Right, let's set that load up real quick. Scroll all the way down, type in image with text. And this is the one, image with text five. We already brought out a few more. So this is our newest one. I'm just gonna put it right here. It looks good right there. Always save it up before you start using it. Like that, you don't run into any possible errors and it just goes smoother. So the first thing I would like to do is showcase you how those blocks work. So I'm gonna click on one. That is the first you're seeing. Here you can see the headline. It says, Beach Wear, Live Your Life. That's a little sub line right there. And there you have the following text and the button as well. And here we're gonna select an image we would like to see in that case. I'm just gonna use a few images of that little rock brand of a friend of mine. So I'll put that one in. This is looking nice and to maybe match the colors a bit better. Actually, this one is looking pretty fine. I'm gonna show you on the next one. So yeah, this is how that worked. And instead of Beachwear, I would like to have Beach View, just to show you that it's getting updated live. So for this one, I would like to switch to the next one. I do that by clicking on those buttons right here. And here you can see already, it's blue. And the reason for that is that this default version has everything in blue. You can also just delete that one. And at the end of the day, the default one is always gonna be the orange one, but we'll just stick with the blue one in that case. So here, I would like to pick something which has a little more blue in it. Let's just see, or something really, really flat. Maybe I'll go for that one because the curtain looks a little bit blue in that one. And we're gonna switch back. To that one yeah that is looking nice we're just gonna stick with that one let's just chuck in a little product of ours in there so i can showcase you later that the button is working as well and the last one we could also do does contain a lot of green as you can see right here so i'll stick with the green rug i'll just put that one in and here we're gonna do green heaven rug perfect that is how you can customize those blocks right here. So I'll just show you how it's going to look like. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Now I'm gonna click on the main block itself because there is something we can do as well. I'm just gonna do an autoplay delay, make it a little bit smaller. Let's chuck it down to three seconds. And here are a bunch of customizations you can do to the whole thing, like deciding where the headline is being positioned. You can change the fonts where the sub headline is being positioned and a bunch of other stuff. But I'm just gonna go over this real quick and here we could do also, let's check on that. Yeah, here we did a little switch around. So this is getting positioned on a different spot where the text is going to be. And yeah, the last thing we could do is just adding a few more details to that, adding some dots, some margins, 
and also some max height to the images and we can also decide if it's getting shown on mobile or not but i'm pretty happy with it being shown on both devices i'm just going to show you the mobile version so i can show you that it's working in both versions this is looking really nice to me i'm going to save it a lot and we will have a final look in the live version before we can actually round this one up let's open up the live version right here of my little test store and yeah there we have it let's check if the autoplay is working it is working perfectly fine i set it to three seconds and exactly after three seconds the next one is getting shown and i do think it's a really nice way to visually show products or just new collections whatever you prefer and here we can see that the button is working as well and yeah with that being done and successfully showing we can round this one up and if you guys like that always feel free to leave a like and a follow and have a good one and peace out